if you look at our earnings, I think third quarter we begin to see the group revenue on a total basis already grow year to year. But quarter four, we actually see each of the three major business groups actually saw revenue growth. Uh, again, looking at the market trend, looking at, I think, the order book that we have, I think we are very confident, uh, I think, that the business will continue to grow. Now, Lenovo announced its AI strategy back in October uh, together with a line of AI PCs, so Qualcomm Snapdragon X Elite chip with Microsoft Copilot AI. Mm -hmm available to be sold in China by the end of this month. Are you gunning to be the first to market and have that first mover advantage? Well, we announced our first uh, AIPC in China, I think in, earlier part, in the early May, uh, expecting shipment, uh, I think, to be the end of, the, uh, within this month, I think hopefully it will be next, within the next week. Uh, we'll continue to actually roll out products, uh, and we are very, very optimistic that I think the market will uh, I think we'll, we'll, we'll like our products, uh, and, and that's one reason why we believe that I think growth can be sustained, I think, going forward. Your company has said that AI PCs mark a major inflection point for the industry. What kind of demand are you anticipating, and do you expect people to hold off on the refresh in anticipation for the AI PC? Yeah, I think the penetration will slowly go up, uh, I think, based on our own estimate, I think initially maybe uh, we, we have, in fact, AIPC, uh, I think there are very different definitions. I think using the IDC definition uh, or using our own definition, uh, I think we believe that the initial definite this year, I think will be low single digit and then we're growing. Uh, I think there will be a period when people, be, I think, know how, how to the ecosystem, uh, I think getting I think know how to use it, how to improve their either work or their quality of life. I think it will take time to actually, I think, to see the mix going to a much higher number. I think which IDC forecasts about 50% in two years time, something like that. Yeah. AIPCs to grow from the premium to mainstream market over the next three years. Yeah, two, three years, yeah. What kind of numbers are we looking at? Well, I think if you use take IDC as a reference, I think that would be like 50, 60%. In terms of the the total market size. Yeah. All right. Do you have an actual number on the PCs delivered? Uh, well, the, well, I think we we are number one in the market. So I think we always have uh, I think 20, 24, 25 percent. I think I definitely will will believe I definitely believe that I think we will be doing that be able to maintain our number one position in the market, uh, having been number one for such a long period of time, uh, and we will continue to deliver the product which is liked by the market. Qualcomm and Intel have been told by the U.S. government that it is not allowed to export some of its chips mm -hmm. to Huawei. Has Lenovo sized up these risks and when it comes to access to Qualcomm chips? Uh, first of all, Lenovo as a global company, we're doing business in different parts of the world. We always comply with the rules and regulations. I think for market where there are components available, we obviously will be able to, I think, have alternative source to satisfy the customer of the market. 